How's your medical supplies? Lieutenant General Joe Anderson says right now with Afghan National Security Forces. First aid kits, combat life Like everybody. this Army Corps Everybody's commander, nice. a little encouragement, what some could call tough love, goes a long way. It doesn't take a lot of hard Very pushing good. or tough love. My job is See to be a good parts. partner with them, it's to be a good friend with them. So when it comes to talking with them, helping them understand the environment they're dealing with, by and large it's helping them understand more of the picture. The picture is as complex as Afghanistan itself. Anderson commands International Security Assistance Force Joint Command, a position he'll hold until the end of Operation Enduring Freedom, when the mission and the job will officially end. Between now and then, though, there's work to be done. The issue for Corps commanders is the challenges of the higher war fight. How do you integrate air with ground operations, indirect fire in support of operations, intelligence-based operations? They all vary in their capabilities on leadership, training, manning, equipping. Uh, but by and large, the Corps commanders have a much bigger role in integrating. How well Afghanistan endures post-2014 depends greatly on the capability of the ANSF. The main thing is everything I've worked for. For Anderson, it means keeping tabs on those in charge, building confidence while encouraging the tenets of leadership. They, from Kabul, from commandos to they can fight, he says, but keeping the peace is a long-term commitment. The issue is sustainability. They got to be able to do that throughout a fighting season that goes all the way out to the fall. You kind of no, you keep, your, they're uh, up to it. No, it's always good to see you. Afghans, we'll he says, are ready. All it takes right now is a touch of tough love. Gail McCabe, Afghanistan.